isn't that right? Like, I get, you know, what you've done. I get where you're coming from 100%. But when you got somebody like me that damn near got shot and killed on fucking Friday, dude, that shit fucking changed my life, dude. That shit made me think about a lot of shit. And it made me fucking... Actually, it does. Yo, dude, you got no. Listen, man, you got to think about this, dude. It has a lot to do with you, man. Because when I go, because when that sh when I got fucking shot at, and I realized what fucking happened, that made me fucking realize that life is too goddamn fucking short to stay pissed at your friends. And that's what I was trying to fucking tell you, dude. You need to let what the fuck ever happened the fuck go, because life is too fucking short, dude. I mean, do you really want to look back on your fucking life? And think, why did I stay mad at that person? Or do you want to get the fuck over it, make shit right, and move on? You need to think about that shit. And whenever you said that shit, bro, that's where that ego's coming from, dude. And that's why you need to drop that fucking ego when it comes to that crap, man. That shit that happened to me on Friday, bro, that shit humbled me the fuck up. That made me realize that I need to make shit right with every fucking body and do what I need to fucking do and say, fuck this shit, dude. Yesterday night, I ended up in the fucking hospital because of um, basically eczema that was stress-induced. And it was so bad that a lot of it was bleeding. Thankfully, I got medication for that shit. But, dude, let me tell you right now, man. Since Friday, shit's fucking changed for me, dude. That's why I fucking reached out and was like, dude, like, cut the crap. Like, stop acting like you're bigger than everybody else, dude. And you don't say, and you don't say, and you, yeah, but dude, listen, yeah, but dude, you can't, but listen, yo, dude, I, I explain, I, I, I explain that shit, shut the fuck up, dude, I, I explain that, it don't matter, bro, I, I, dude, I explained to you about that shit, and you fucking understood, I thought you understood what the fuck was really going on, dude. Well, 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 let me tell you something, bro. Half my friends that I fucking grew up with, they know about what's going on, and they got a target on their back, but do you think they let that bother them? No, they're still my fucking friend. And that's why I told you when I called your ass out, were we ever really friends from the jump? Because real friends don't fucking turn on real friends, dude, and that's exactly what you fucking did. When you know, oh, bull fucking... No, you fucking turned on me, dude. When you were going through some shit, I... Listen, bro, when I, then, oh, I know you're not, but here's the thing, though, bro, if you, if you, by you doing what you fucking did, dude, by you sitting there saying, by you sitting there, by you sitting there, by you sitting there saying what you're saying, bro, that's basically stabbing me in the fucking back. I've, dude, I've, had, I've had your, yeah, well, you know what? And you know how I am when it comes to the truth, dude. And I've been nothing but honest with you 110% of the time. You knew what was going on. You know what these guys are trying to do. You know what the fuck they're about. And you know damn well I want nothing to do with that shit. Yeah, well, you know what? Let me tell you something, bro. Oh, my God. Dude, I was not calling you out like that the other day. When I made that video reaching out to you, I was trying to put the past... Fucking behind me, dude. I was trying to move. Then, then why? Then why? Uh, in order to, you know, it doesn't matter. Yeah, but dude, would you rather be hung up on the fucking past, or would you rather move the fuck on it? Would you rather move the fuck on from the past? Would you rather? No, would you rather? No, shut the. No, the fuck you haven't, obviously, dude. Because if you have, then why the fuck you still bringing it up? Why ain't you saying? Because I was trying to make a fucking men's with you, bro. It wasn't the, it wasn't the, it wasn't the call, it wasn't the call you out. It was to be like, look, this shit went the fuck down, and this shit ain't cool. But for you to sit there and still bring that up, nah, dude. Ignore him, dude. Ignore him. Fucking isn't it? I didn't start. Here's the thing, dude. It's called. It's called, it's called ignoring them. Yeah, you know what? That's, that's how you... Oh, really? Oh, really? I've got, you're the one with the bitch-ass fucking ego, bro. I get that you burned it. 
No, no, fucking then just because you got it. Just, just because you, just because you, just, shut the fuck up, dude. Shut the fuck up, man. Just because, just, just, just because you have a fucking ego, bro. Just because you've earned that ego, that don't make you better than me. That don't make you better than anyone. That's how you fuck. That's how you fucking act, bro. Have you ever once? Have you ever once? Yes, I gained a massive fucking fan base the way that you did. I earned that shit. But do you see me putting you down? Do you see me acting like I'm better than anybody? No. I treat every single person that I fucking come across with fucking respect. But what do you fucking do? You sit there and do this shit, bro. And that's stupid. You say, I got a lot to learn now, motherfucker. You need to grow the fuck up. I thought... Stop acting like a little boy. Stop. Uh, no, right? It's, yeah, all you fucking do is sit there and run your fucking mouth about how, oh, he's repeating myself. Well, gee, maybe, well, maybe, well, guess fucking what? I have a fucking reason to, don't I, man? You think I asked to be drunk into this fucking shit? No, I didn't. For the past five, for the past five years, motherfucker, I've been trying to get out of this shit. But let me tell you something, it's not as easy as you fucking think, bro. You ain't in my position, so you ain't got to write the fucking judge or make calls on it, bro. You don't know what the fuck I've been through for the past five years. For the past five years... Dude, I have been talked down on. I have been destroyed. I've had shit ripped away from me. Hard work. Thrown down the fucking drain. Everything, bro. You don't know what it's like to be in my position. So you have no fucking right to say shit. You don't have that right, man. You really don't. For the past five years, I've been trying to get out of this shit. I've been trying to do good for myself like you've been wanting me to do. Like I told you in that stream where I reached out to you, man, I want to be on that level to where you're at. I want to be able to do what's right for myself. But it's kind of hard to do when people keep on attacking your real fucking life, attacking your fucking family, sending dead animals to your fucking doorstep, doing shit like what they tried to do to me on Friday night. You think that's easy? Hell no. I guarantee you, man, you wouldn't last five fucking seconds through the shit that I've been through, man. You wouldn't make it five seconds, man. I've been through this shit for over five years. All because of some sick fuck. Can't seem to get a hint that I want nothing. Like I said, I know what you're gonna say. Ignore it. But like I said, bro, that's a lot easier said than fucking done, dude. It really is. You don't... No, the fuck it's not, dude. No, not when you're in my position today, bro. Not when you're in my position today, man. You don't have people like... Dude, I've had people... Dude, you don't think that Friday night didn't fuck with me for the rest of my goddamn life? You don't think that people... You don't... 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 Like I told you, man, they shot from the outside of my fucking house. They climbed on our neighbor's... Dude, they climbed on our nearest roof that's not even 10 feet away, shot the bullet through the windowsill into my fucking bed. And you want to know what the fucking cops that came out here the next day said? They're not going to do shit to get the bullet out. So we had to fucking wait until whoever fucking shot it. I don't know if it's the real person that wrote the letter or not, but we're taking it as that is the person that wrote it. They fucking flat out said, oh, we're going to come back and finish the job if you tell the cops. So we fucking showed the goddamn police. And finally, something might be able to do something about it, dude. You think that I... It's still lodged in the fucking bed, dude. Dude, the bullet's lodged in the bed. I'm not fucking touching that goddamn mattress. That's for the cops to do, man. That's for the goddamn police to do. Because if I... Tell you, dude, I... Dude. Dude. Look at the fucking pictures that I sent you, dude. Uh, uh, yes, sir. Dude. Dude, look at the fucking windowsill. You see where that fucking hole is? That's where it went through. That little hole right there where that, where that split open is on the windowsill? That's where it threw. And here's the fucking entrance to my goddamn bed. That's where it fucking went in at. It went through the window. Dude, dude, you don't, you don't see that fucking hole right there in the fucking windowsill. You don't see that jagged fucking edge hole right there in the windowsill. You don't see that shit. Dude, are you blind or stupid, dude? Look at the fucking windowsill, dude. 
The one on the bottom one? Yeah, that's where the fucking bullet went into. That's where the fucking bullet went in. And if you look at that white part on the bottom of the windowsill where that jagged hole is, that's where the bullet came in at, dude. Now what, now what, round, now what round it was, we're not fucking sure. The outside or the inside? All right, hold on. All right, hold on. I mean, do this real quick. Now, let me ask you this, smartass. If it's such a fucking... If that's a screwdriver punch, then why the fuck do I have it on goddamn video where the fucking shit happened? And I can show you the video right the fuck now very easily. I know I... Dude, where'd the fucking photo go? I know I just took a picture of it. Oh, wait, that's the video. Hold on. That's the thing, dude. We got all the time in the world. It just depends on how you fucking use it. Like I said, dude, you don't think, like I told you before, you don't think that I don't want to be on that level that you're at? You don't think that I haven't worked my ass off to get to where you helped me get to, man? Do you have any idea how fucking pissed off I was? But, dude, you don't think I was... Actually, actually... Actually, you know what really happened, dude? When it came to Twitch, what fucking happened? As you saw, I was doing very, very good. Wasn't bothering anybody, wasn't doing anything. I was on my shit every fucking day. You know what they fucking did? They, those fucking assholes, falsely reported me. You want to know why? Because that little dickhead, William Glory Hole, I said on stream many times, including afterwards, that he'll do whatever it takes to keep me from making money. He don't fucking care. And when he saw that I was making money on Twitch, that's when he fucking banned me. I got lucky that I got the payout on Twitch that I got. I just have, I barely had enough money to get a brand new computer, which I have now. I barely got lucky and got that. Actually, no, I got paid out 111. It was 116 with tax. Hey, it's better than what I was running before. And it's a Windows 10 Pro. It's way better than what I was running before. I'm trying to find my fucking goddamn charge cord so I can send you this shit, dude. And name them off. Name them off right now and I'll get fucking rid of them. No, name them off. No, name, no. No, motherfucker. Name them off right. Name them off. Name them off right the fuck now and I'll get rid of them. Yeah. Oh really? Oh really? You want you want you want to talk about fucking helping me? Then fucking name them off, motherfucker. If you want, yeah. Because, because you're a little because you're a little fucking pussy that don't want to fucking do shit to fucking help your friend. That's hands your back. Yeah, okay. Hey, guess what? You're not fucking doing shit to hell, bro. If you really wanted to, if you, if well, guess what? You want, you, want, you want me to do good, right? Yes or no? You want me to do good, right? You want me to be good, right? Then fucking end up. You don't think I haven't tried, motherfucker? I fucking tried. I fucking tried. You don't fucking get it, bro. It's not that easy being in my damn position. You can't say shit because you've never been in that position, bro. You've never gone through what I've went through. You haven't gone through the shit that I went through, dude. So you can't speak on something you don't know shit about. 
You don't know shit about what I've been through, dude. You ain't never been in my position. So what makes you think you have the right to fucking speak on something that you've never gone through? You don't have that right. So unless you've been through that shit, set the fuck down and shut the fuck up because you ain't never been through it, dude. I have. You don't think I ain't tried to listen to you? I have. Multiple fucking times. But it's kind of hard to fucking do when your family's always being attacked, your friends lose their jobs, you end up losing your job with friends because these people that don't want to see you making any money or progress. That ain't on me, bro. That's on them. I tried to stay on the straight and narrow. I tried to stay on the straight and narrow like you fucking told me to do. Oh, man, if you're going to do this, then fuck you and fuck your... Either name off the fucking trolls right now or we got nothing else to say. Either start, either no, either start naming them off or I'm calling your ass out again and making you look dumb as fuck. So if I was you, I'd shut the fuck up and I'd start naming them off real fucking fast. Because you and I both know I have a fan base that will come at you. Because right now, you're acting like a fucking prick and you need to humble the fuck up and shut the fuck up. So if you want to face you, no. No, if you, want, if, you want, if you want to fucking help, then be a fuck. You talking about being a friend? Then be a fucking friend and name those motherfuckers off. If you want to be a friend, name them fucking off right the fuck out. Then name them out. Then name them out. Name out the goddamn trolls right now. Name them out. Then fuck you. Then fuck you. And fuck, then fuck you and fuck your family and fuck your fan base, bitch boy. You're nothing but a prick ass little bitch that's got an ego that his body can't fucking cash. So fuck your goddamn ego and fuck everything you're about and fuck your life. I'm done with you, man. I'm done being walked on by little pricks like you that think they're better than me. Oh, bullshit. That's what you're doing right now. So fuck.